Hi everyone and welcome to another very exciting tutorial. I didn't plan to shoot this today, so uh, I just wanted to share what I read this morning. And um, I'd like to show you right now what it is about. On the left, you can see a, well, a gift code that looks pretty similar to what you would expect from an iTunes or App Store gift card. So what it is, is a promo code of an application I've created for a Sprite Kit game course that is not yet released, but you can go ahead and download it anyways. It's completely free. But what you can see here is actually a promo code for that game. And now on the right, I've opened up um, the new App Store. It does not have to be an iOS 11 App Store. You can actually do that with um, iOS 10, 9, and so on. And there is this feature to redeem a gift card by scanning this code on the back of such a gift card when I use the camera. And I can now just point that camera on my display or on a printed card and actually get this app for free and download it from the App Store. So I just um, allowed that using my uh, fingerprint and now it actually should process and get me to the App Store and I can open up the app. Very cool. So this is what you can do with a little hack. And I'd like to give you some more details about that. I did not come up with this procedure. It's um, a blog post originating from a company called Equinox. It's um, not a, a sponsored video here, so I just read that on their blog. And what they tried is figuring out how to actually um, copy that behavior from an iTunes gift card. So they went out and looked how can they do that. And this blog post is really entertaining. It describes how they actually figured out how to do it. And as it seems, um, the secret for that is Apple's secret font, which is used here. So you can also do that if you have that font. So the question is, how do you get that font? It's not a standard font. Um, you can't Google it. You can't got it on dafont.com or uh, wherever you would think about getting it. So just keep on reading and reading and reading. And they then went to into the bundle of iTunes and found a, another bundle, which is called Code Redeemer. And there they found a um, they found a path to system library, private frameworks, core recognition framework, and so on, including a fonts folder. And once I copy that, or once you copy that, and um, go to your finder, open the go menu, and go to the folder, uh, you can just copy and paste that path, and go to that folder, and there you will find two fonts. Um, and I'm selecting those fonts now, opening them up, and then you can just install those two fonts and create your own gift card for your own app promotions. So uh, they also provided a sketch template for that, um, also with the dimensions of the box that is required um, for the code. And so I just went ahead and downloaded the sketch template. You can also download a Photoshop template. Um, you will find a link to that blog post in the video description below. So I went uh, to sketch, opened up sketch, and just added my logo here of the game and added a nice front and, um, and entered a promo code in this box. And just if you're uh, curious about how to generate promo codes, it's very easy if, you have, um, if you're a registered developer and you open up your iTunes Connect, then you will find a promo code section in the features section of your application. There I generated one promo code. The app is free, but nevertheless, um, you can create a promo code for promotion purposes, such as what we just did. So you can go ahead and copy that code, paste it into the sketch template, and um, then the magic you've seen earlier in this video can happen. You can print that uh, on a business card, use it for whatever promo purposes you'd like for your app. So so this is what uh, they came up, what Equinox came up with, and I think it's extremely cool. Um, so why don't you go ahead and try this out yourself? I thank you so much um, for your attention for this very short video, and I'll see you in the next one.